तम युद्धम अव्यक्त वर्तमानी अभिवेशित आत्मा सह ही ब्रह्म कर्म बीजम सी सीड ऑफ वर्ल्डली एक्टिविटीज रजसा उपरक्त इनिशिएटेड बाय द मोड ऑफ पैशन प्रजा लिविंग एंटिटीज शिश्रुक्षण विलिंग टू क्रिएट प्रोजनी ये ऑल द फाइव कॉसेस ऑफ क्रिएशन एवा दस दृष्टवा लुकिंग ऑन अस्ट प्रेड फॉर विसर्ग क्रिएशन आफ्टर द क्रिएशन बाय द लॉर्ड अभिमुख towards tam that idiom worshipable avyakta transcendental vatmani on the path of abhiveshita fixed atma mind translation purport by the divine grace ac bhaktivedanta swami shri prabhupad translation lord brahma thus being surcharged with the mode of passion became inclined to create and after seeing the five causes of creation indicated by the personality of godhead he began to offer his respectful prayers on the path of the creative mentality please repeat lord brahma thus being surcharged with the mode of passion became inclined to create and after seeing the five causes of creation indicated by the personality of godhead he began to offer his respectful prayers on the path of the creative mentality purport by shri prabhupad even if one is in the material mode of passion to create something in the world he has to take shelter of the supreme for the necessary energy that is the path of the successful termination of any attempt the sense the bhakti vedanta purports of the third canto eighth chapter of the shrimad bhagavatam entitled manifestation of brahma from garbhodakshay vishnu o madhyana timiran dhasya gyanan jana shalakaya chakshudun militam ena tasmay shri gurave namaha नमा ओं विष्णुपादाया कृष्ण प्रेषा भूतले श्रीमते भक्तिदातस्वामीनामिने नमस्ते सारस्वते देवे गौरवाणी प्रचारिणे निर्विशेषा शून्यवादी पाश्चातेशतारिणे जय श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु निनंद श्रीअद्वैतगाधरा श्रीवासादी गौरभक्तवृंद हरे कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा कृष्ण कृष्णा हरे 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 रामा हरे रामा राम रामा हरे हरे दिस टू आर द कंक्लूडिंग वर्सेस ऑफ दिस चैप्टर मैनिफेस्टेशन ऑफ ब्रह्मा फ्रॉम विष्णु लॉर्ड ब्रह्मा 
is uh, scrutinizingly having darshan of the supreme personality of godhead garbhodaka shai vishnu and then we have seen how brahma is comparing lord's beauty with various examples to make us understand the how the lord's form is very unique and extraordinary he compares the lord's body with a coral mountain then as a mountain and then as a tree so in the last verse we have seen he has recognized him as hari because such wonderful form can be manifested only by the supreme lord and as soon as isra isa shri hari then immediately he is able to see the darsha devo jagataha he saw the creation whatever the lord has created already nata param loka visarga drushti hi he saw the lord vishnu's navel he saw the lotus flower he also saw the devastating water and the drying air and the sky all became visible to him so this is this is called darshan if one has darshan of krishna then he has no ignorance he will know everything else yasmin vidnyate whoever understands krishna then he understands everything krishna's energies and those energetic manifestations everything becomes visible to him and then here we see as soon as he had darshan of krishna then he immediately is inspired to do his service advanced devotees will be able to uh, get inspiration by having darshan of the deities uh, so here brahma is an advanced devotee so as soon as he had darshan of the lord uh, then he became surcharged uh, with the inclination to create which is actually his service so here it is mentioned praja sushrukshan iyat the five causes of the creation eva drushtva indicated by the supreme lord and then so now he is full of inclination to create and then we actually expect that he starts his work right immediately get into the work and do something is rajasa rajasoparakta is fully surcharged with passion to do something uh, but then uh, interestingly he began to offer his respectful prayers avyakta vartmani abhiveshit atma so he starts his uh, prayers actually in the next chapter we will see brahma's prayers for creative energy this is the next chapter so although he is surcharged with the uh, <coughs> inclination to create he starts his first business by offering his prayers to krishna because he understood what are those five causes of creation uh, so the uh, again the other day i already gave this examples elsewhere <clears throat> i came across this uh, example and so there is uh, one company which has started working on one global dream their project name is the global dream 2 and what is this global dream they want to construct the biggest ship possible ever on the globe that's why it's called global dream and uh, two companies came together there's a germany and hong kong based company 
सम एम वी वर्सटन वर्सा कंपनीज ने सो दे केम टूगेदर दे वॉन्टेड टू बिल्ड दिस मेगा शिप एंड देन वट इज़ द कैपेसिटी इट इज नाइन थाउजेंड पैसेंजर्स नाइन थाउजेंड पैसेंजर्स कैन फिट इन टू इट एंड देन इट हैज बजट ऑफ लेवन थाउजेंड क्रॉर्स लेवन थाउजेंड क्रॉर्स वी कंप्लीटेड दिस टेम्पल इन ट्वेंटी फाइव क्रॉर्स so how many temples you can create eleven thousand crores they have that money and then what is that uh, ship meant for it's called vihara <laughs> that means it's a pleasure cruise pleasure means same things uh, what are the same things they have a outdoor water park they have a cinema hall and uh, all the other whatever generally available on the land and the ship size is 1/3 km and then 2 lakh tons and then 20 floors or 20 floors maximum we have 4 5 floors here no imagine 20 floors such a huge it's really a global dream they started off uh, with all this and um, <clears throat> the works are about to get completed and uh, it is actually lying in uh, one shipyard in germany it was about to get completed they are actually wanting to sell this ship to somebody else they are in a rush to complete because everybody will have schedules and then when they are about to complete the company which is actually doing all this that went bankrupt paisa nahi hai nobody is giving money so the shipyard has given a notice that you have to remove the ship as quickly as possible <laughs> so now they have global dream too in front of their eyes not able to complete the finishes And meanwhile money is not there so uh, they decided to now uh, <clears throat> sell it as a scrap scrap means you know they will now dismantle they sell up the engine they sell up the cabin door all those things they start selling it off <laughs> uh, so it's a telugu article they have mentioned it as thukku <laughs> uh, the new ship which never entered into the waters has become a scrap and then uh, they are selling it then i became a little curious why it is called global dream 2 and then for sure the article also has covered that uh, message <laughs> they say they already built one global dream 1 which is also not sold <laughs> and it is lying in the same port uh, they are uh, but they are not uh, deterred they are very hopeful they again build global dream to <laughs> which they are now turning into scrap and somebody asked why are you not turning the global dream one into scrap they said we still have hopes <laughs> that is already completed many years back uh, so they have a dream they have put in 11000 crores and uh, you know they did a lot of work but they could not accomplish what they wanted to accomplish their dreams came to a halt and then you know it became a scrap why is that because many people think that uh, you know to accomplish to get success in this life uh, many people think that you know we need to just pump in some money and work hard day and night then yes you'll be able to do it first thing they look at it is money 
Yeah, so this is what it is. <clears throat> but here, Lord has, yet means he has indicated there are five causes of creation. Now, what are those five causes? That is mentioned in Bhagavad Gita, Panchaitani Mahabaho. There are five Karanani Nibodame. We should uh, clearly understand these five factors if you want to accomplish anything or you want to succeed anything. And uh, where is this Nibodhame? Krishna is explaining and he is quoting from Sankhya Krutani Proktam. <coughs> so, from the uh, <coughs> Sankhya philosophy, it is mentioned here Siddhaye Sarva Karmana Siddhi. You want to get Siddhi, success, accomplishment, then these are the five factors. What is the first factor? Adhisthanam. Adhisthanam means for our individual case, it refers to the body. This is called Adhisthanam. For a business, it refers to place. Hmm? <clears throat> for example, uh, you want to set up a temple. Huh? What, what is the place? Where you want to establish a temple? That's the first question. Adhisthanam. We can establish a temple. Uh, you know, there's so much of place is there anywhere. You can establish. Generally, spiritualists, they feel Jai Radha Govinda Kij. Generally, spiritualists will feel that, okay, you know, for my japa or for my rituals and austerities, we can go far away from the city, somewhere peacefully, you know, you can do a little bit of uh, cultivation, farming, this, that, all that. I can do my japa, so I'll settle down there. <laughs> <laughs> Generally, you know, spiritualists will have this. Or some category of transcendentalists are there, they want to be silent, want to be far away, and then, uh, you know, <clears throat> focus on nothing. Uh, they have some, you know, they also want to go away. Uh, but then Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati said, we should establish temples in the crowded cities. He wanted to establish a youth hostel in London city. You, you look at Bhakti Siddhanta's vision in 1920s. And he is uh, asking us to establish Gaudiya Mats in the crowded cities of the world. If somebody wants to go to Rundavan, somebody wants to go to somewhere else and then we want to chant more and then read more and then settle down there, then Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Thakur said, don't get cheated by your mind. It's a cheating by the mind. Huh? Nobody can, uh, you know, simply sit and chant and go on his life day after day. Particularly when we are surcharged with this uh, Rajasopa Raktaha, uh, fully passionate, Already body is surcharged with all this. Now that has to be engaged. That has to be engaged. And that engagement will be given by the Acharya. He is the one who gives us the engagement. So, uh, to burn our uh, passions, our inclinations, and uh, our uh, uh, dovetail, our energies, uh, the Acharyas have given wonderful uh, opportunity. Build the temples in the midst of the city. Within the city, where should we establish the temple? In the most costliest or the most prominent locations of the city. When uh, you know this temple is coming up, you know, a lot of uh, uh, some uh, lot of struggle was there, fighting was there. It became a big news for Landra knows that somebody has come and attacked this temple and all that. And then we went and met one officer. 
he is from he is in the he is connected to this temple and all that the topmost officer and uh, so when we went and met him he said uh, swami ji see this uh, you know why are you attached to this land five acres you are all sadhus swami ji is you have developed you are supposed to develop renunciation <laughs> so why are you attached to this i'll give you 20 acres if you want no you can go outside the city limits there you can establish a temple happily you can live all of your swamiji can live nicely <laughs> will give you why are you attached to all this he asked mm. so this is the common uh, tendency of the people <clears throat> they not understood why, why why are we fighting then we said sir we are uh, this land is uh, belonging to lakshmi narasimha and we are his servants we cannot decide anything else they have decided that this temple has to come up so what can i do he was shocked because narasimha decided means he is he is very he is very careful <laughs> uh-huh. so uh, important point is that uh, lord's wish uh, we will see in this five factors so adhisthana we we are we want to be in the midst of the cities yes it will bring lot of uh, challenges to preach to remain in the cities and to preach it will bring challenges we may have issues with our health issues with uh, many you know other sense objects and so many other challenges are there but then devotee increasingly depends on the lord and then he tries to overcome the challenges devotees don't run away from these challenges they want to go to some corner most part of the world and then somehow practice and then become successful not possible in the corner most world also there will be maya somebody went deep into the water and in is doing meditation and all that suddenly he saw something some two fish engaged in some activity immediately his whole mind has changed the problem is not in the outside world yes it triggers it gives the triggers but we have lot of challenges already inside the world Mm. so <clears throat> propad addresses this in the ajamila past time he gives wonderful instruction when ajamila saw some unusual scene which he had never experienced in his life immediately his uh, mind got attracted and then he uh, you know he succumbed to it so in the purport propad says such scenes are now visible all over those ajamela time is once in a blue moon somewhere he saw something but nowadays it's a, a common scene all over particularly in the western countries those days and uh, in india nowadays this is what it is and propas writes in the purport that if my disciples nicely chant and hear hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 rama hare rama 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 hare so then they will be protected propada knows the challenges one should not think that you know this is a impractical process because because the acharyas have not understood no they have clear idea of what circumstances we are in when bhakti siddhant saraswati thakur is desiring and when the propada is desiring they are clearly aware of our challenges but they know the power of the holy name hmm? they know the challenge but they know the solution and if somebody implements this solution then automatically he will be relieved so adhisthanam so that's where devotees always look for some big big propad whenever he goes to a new city to establish a temple first he will go for a a small tour in the city and then he will say in the in the main junction in the corner there is one building he will say this is nice 
అండ్ కార్నర్ బిగ్ బిల్డింగ్ దిస్ ఈస్ నైస్ సో బికాస్ దట్ ఈస్ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ ప్లేస్ ఈస్ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ అధిష్టానం తథా కర్త కర్త మీన్స్ ద డూవర్ ద లివింగ్ ఎంటిటీ హూ ఇస్ ట్రైన్ టు డూ ట్రైంగ్ టు అచీవ్ సంథింగ్ గెట్ సమ్ సక్సెస్ అండ్ దెన్ కరణం కరణం మీన్స్ ద సెన్సెస్ ఇన్స్ట్రుమెంట్స్ ఇఫ్ అధిష్టానం రిఫర్స్ టు అగ్రికల్చరల్ ఫీల్డ్ కరణం రిఫర్స్ టు ఆల్ దోస్ ఇంప్లిమెంట్స్ you know the tractor these that all those things put together they call karanam uh, so karanam cha prudak vidham prudak vidham means various types of endeavors uh, one has to if one has to obtain success he has to endeavor this way this way this way this way this way this way and finally he can reach the success somewhere krishna opens up and talk uh, that is mentioned he vividha ascha prudak chesta దైవం చైవాత్ర పంచమం సో ఆల్దో హీ మే బి ఎండివరింగ్ ఇన్ వేరియస్ వేస్ దిస్ వే దట్ వే దట్ వే ఫైనల్లీ దైవం కృష్ణ హ్యాస్ టు ఓపెన్ అప్ ద గేట్ ఫర్ సక్సెస్ సో దట్స్ వై దీస్ ఫైవ్ ఫ్యాక్టర్స్ ఆర్ ఇండికేటెడ్ టు బ్రహ్మ అండ్ దోస్ ఫోర్ ఫ్యాక్టర్స్ ఇఫ్ యూ సీ అధిష్టానం తథా కర్త కరణం పృథక్ విధం దే ఆల్ కమ్ అండర్ ద control of uh, material nature which is actually working under the will of the supreme lord again uh, so ultimately the primary factor is daivam cha chaivatra panchamam so ultimate the factor is krishna is the ultimate factor if krishna's favorable will is there then there is a favorable guidance of the material energy and the material energy will produce favorable results material energy works according to our consciousness if our consciousness is polluted uh, then karma and so many other things will come into force and um, uh, if the devotee's consciousness is that i want to offer all these things as a, for the pleasure of my guru it is my spiritual master's wish he is the leader he is the uh, he is the doer i am trying my best to do my little part if somebody keeps the consciousness pure and then wanting to achieve something for krishna then krishna switches that energy uh, material energy becomes spiritual energy which is uh, which is uh, you know all uh, uh what do you say all auspicious the result will be very auspicious so it's all in the hands of the lord if our consciousness is polluted then we will get tapakari uh, a mixture of all this plus minus all those things but if the consciousness is very pure hmm, and we take up the project uh, we take up the activity in our day to day life and immediately uh, we will be protected we will be under the auspicious energy of the supreme lord so after explaining these five factors krishna he mentions uh, what are these five factors are they applicable only to projects or something no here it is said sharira van mano bhiya karma prarabhate nara nyayam cha viparitam va parichaite tasya hetavah is a very Uh, important verse here it is said whatever right or wrong action a man performs by body mind or speech is caused by these five factors these five factors are even there even for the mind that means if a thought has to come or you have to do some work within the mind there also five factors are there if something uh, wrong happens even in the thought there still there are five factors are there. Hmm. so speech something goes wrong there are also five factors are there or goes right nicely you are able to present the concept or this and that that is also five factors so manasa vacha and karmana and these three uh, aspects are under the control of these five factors that means you can see lord's control 
on our existence. Even a thought is being directed and controlled by the Supreme Lord. So that's why if somebody thinks that uh, tatraivam uh, sati kartaram atmanam kevalam tuyaha, if somebody thinks kevalam me, I did it. Hmm? So he is uh, then pashyati akruta buddhitvan, that is buddhi is not developed, he is not very intelligent. Why? Nasapashyati dhurmati, you cannot see the things as they are. Seeing the things as they are means you have to see five factors. Whatever plus or minus that has happened, manasa vacha karmana, there are five factors are there. A devotee, if he is conscious of these five factors, so much he can become Krishna conscious. Otherwise, his success will deviate him because he thinks kevalam atmanam kevalam tu yaha. He thinks I am the only cause for all the results that are obtained by me. Uh, so that uh, then uh, that is uh, he cannot see the things uh, uh, as they are. So that's why uh, here Brahma, of course, is an exalted personality. He understood that these are the five factors and Krishna's good wishes are required, his blessings are needed and that's why we see, that's why he has not jumped into any work. He now first started offering prayers to Krishna. So this should be our mood. Before we start any of our works, pray to Krishna. You know, pray to Guru and Krishna that my Lord, I am trying to do my services by your blessings. I will be able to uh, here Prabhupada is saying, this is the path of successful termination of any attempt. We may make many attempts, but if you want successful termination, then Krishna's uh, good wishes are required. And that's why Brahmaji is praying for it. We'll stop here. Shri Prabhupada ki jha, Shemad Bhagavatam ki jha. श्री कृष्णुन्नी चेर को वड़ाने की वृंदा वनम भाई पूर्व कलेश तुन्ना ये मनोत्री कैलासम चेर को वड़ाने की परुगुलतीस तुन्ना गंगोत्री सिंकरों निशांत परचडम लक्षणगा पांडवों निर्मिंचना केदारनाथ आच्यात्मिक साधना कु स्पूर्ति निचे आ नरुडो नारायण नड़ायारे न प्रदेशम बद्रिनाथ इनालुगुदा रंडी ये महोन्नत यात्रलो भागस्वामलमोधा हरे कृष्णा गोल्डन टेंपल वारी मरो अपुरूप कानुका हरे कृष्णा वाणी आध्यात्मिका मास पत्रिका ये प्रू मोबाइल ऐप द्वारा कूड़ा सुलभंगा पत्रिकलो चदुकुने सौकर्यम वार्षिक सभ्यत्वम भगवत गीता भागवत प्रवचनालु स्पूर्ति संदेशालु इनका मरिन्नो सदुपायालतो हरे क्रिष्णवाणी मोबाइल आप नेडे डाउनलोड चेस कोंडे मरिन्नी विवराल कोसम कॉल चेन